तो हेलो एंड वेलकम बैक गाइस इट्स मी शिशुई बैक विद अनदर डिस्कॉर्ड जेस वर्जन 14 वीडियो सो एज यू ऑल नो डिस्कॉर्ड जेस वर्जन 13 इज डेड सो द मैसेज एम बट थिंग डू नॉट वर्क एट ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू मेक दिस कूल कमांड सो दैट यू कैन हैव अ गुड कमांड एंड एज वेल एज लर्न अबाउट आवर न्यू एम बट बिल्डर यू आर गोइंग टू इंपोर्ट दिस थिंग फ्रॉम आवर डिस्कॉर्ड जेस पैकेज बिकॉज़ वी कैन नो लोंगर यूज दीस ऑब्जेक्ट्स वेल वी कैन यूज देम बट आवर कलर्स विल मेस अप so afterwards we have our data in which we are giving the name of the command description and we have lot of options first of all the channel in which the person want to send the embed for the channel type some bring 0.5 that means the guild text and the guild news channels only well you can also provide this thing and make sure to import channel type from your package but i like to do 0.5 because it's lovely and then we have some various optional options title that will url description image thumbnail author Color, footer text, footer icon. You can even add uh, stuff like timestamps, but I don't really want to. We have the timeout. We have the permissions. Manage guild. That's how the text work in version 14. All right, 13.1 do not works. And then we are first of all getting all the options, and then we are doing this thing. Uh, we are checking if we have no text or image options. We are saying, yo, you have to at least provide one of them. Well, you can remove it. We don't really need it. I will tell you why. Then we are just replying them and saying, yo, we are sending the embed and the color is yellow. So here you see it. we have to use dot set color well because if i type if i do something like color and i do yellow here that is not going to work if you remember i did i got that issue in the last video create the embed array and then we will do new embed builder that means we are creating an object of our embed and then in our options first of all we are providing the title and then we are using the dot, dot set color and now for more detailed explanation we have this thing channel dot send so here we have each and every damn option we just don't have the timestamp for that you can do something as simple as let me just show you timestamp and just provide some time like you can do date dot now if you want to but i don't really want to do it but let's do it all right so first of all we are providing in the title title is this string from this option we have the thumbnail for thumbnail we have to provide them the url all right then we have the image then we have the description and now in our footer we have text and the icon all right and now we have url that is the title url then we have our author we have our timestamp so this stuff is pretty much similar but we are providing this as an value as a parameter in the constructor as you guys can see it is inside this new embed builders circle or bracket or whatever we call it then we are doing dot set color and bam so if the message is sent that means dot then we are just replying editing the reply to the interaction and saying message is sent description jump to this message and the color is dark green So the main thing is dot set color. Otherwise, we could have used the same thing which I used to use. And then we have dot catch thing in which we are just saying yo, unable to send the message. We have this issue. Probably this is an error. And then we are setting the color and bam. So that's all we are doing. And now let me just run this command real quick and show you how it actually works. Slash embed channel. As you can see, only text channels are available here. We will do general. And for title, I'm just gonna do hello world. And for title URL, let's just copy this url and paste it in each and every damn url we don't care about description we care about image we care about thumbnail let's do something different for our thumbnail right so after thumbnail we have the color here we can do something cool like that because it is supported by discord or we can just provide them some hex code like hashtag #ff0000 and apart from that we have our author author i can just oh well we have a issue guys i forgot one thing our author its type is supposed to be 6 it is supposed to be a user i'm really sorry in our author thing we have to do get user all right get user my bad i will reload this command and it will work and boom sending the embed it said said the embed and as you can see chishu jan hello world why not we have the things as well i think the thumbnail didn't worked as you guys can see apart from that everything worked perfectly we also have the timestamps as you can see and if you want you can remove them if you want you can add an option which is which can be a boolean or something so the moral of the story is thumbnail is not working so let's check it out oh yeah i think it was a spelling error guys my bad there was a spelling error now it is fixed now thumbnail should work as well let me just fix the spelling wait a second slash embed channel will be general then we will have thumbnail and then we have this url let me just copy it real quick paste it enter and now it will work and bam it added the thumbnail and that's how we create embeds and the upcoming videos will be quite cool i mean like it it will be more about discord js 13 to discord js 14 and then i'm going to create some devlogs and thanks a lot for watching i will meet you later in another video till then bye